One player come coach Francis Dairo scored his 11th goal of the season 19 minutes into the game amid all celebration from the home fans. <laughs> But his efforts were cancelled out by Jericho's forward O'Neill Omondi at the stroke of halftime, forcing the duel to earn in a stalemate. <laughs> Dairo's West Conference title hopefuls head into the mid-season break a happy lot, as the outcome means they increased their point tally to an impressive 36 points, having topped the log for 11 successive week after 11 wins and two draws in their last 15 games. Which is Ambaya, Tatuja lose. We were targeting three points, but unfortunately, as I told you, one goal is enough. But uh, you could, how to could defend? We, lose, we lost our concentration in the first half, last nine minutes, last two minutes to concede bow. But that we have to correct that. Despite dropping to fourth position on 28 points, Jericho coach Thomas Okongo was satisfied with the draw. pressure. <laughs> Lakini lucky ko pande tu. Kitu na shukuru. Kwa point moja ni muhimu lakini kwa taka 3 points. Also a boxing association of Kenya chairman Francis Kameta has called for more effort to be put into promoting boxing at all levels in the country. Ile muhimu kabisa kutaja ni kwamba tulikuwa kwa na kwanza Kisumu, ligi ya kwanza Kisumu ya pili na Nyuki na hii ni ya tatu leo. Na inaonekana kila tunapoongezea siku mchezo wa Ndondi unaendelea kuwa ama kuboreka zaidi. Kwa hivyo tunashukuru uh, wadhamini wetu wa Sport Pesa na ni muhimu kwamba nasema kwamba wadhamini wengine waje ambao watakaoifanya huu mchezo uwe mkubwa zaidi umeona kwamba kumekuwa na improvement kubwa sana katika mchezo wa ndoti kupitia udhamini wetu wa, wa Sport Pesa. Kameta spoke as Fred Ramogi of KDF beat Kimathi Kinoti of police to take KDF's point tally to 19 after the third round of the National League that was held in Thika. Francis Dairo wa Kawangwara United alifunga bao lake la kumina moja msimu huu baada ya deka kumina tisa la... Lakini mshambulizi Onilo Mondi wa Jericho kasawazisha kapi